in this video lecture i am going to evaluate limit x tend to 0 tan x minus sin x divided by sin qx so let's see the answer so first here writing limit x tend to 0 this here tan x minus sin x divided by sin qx so here after limit x tend to 0 this we can easily achieve the output if i use here if i convert tan into sin cos form so tan we can write sin x by cos x this here sin x after that this here sin x into sin s square x we can write after that here writing limit x tend to 0 sin is the common take that and here you can get 1 minus cos x divided by cos x and this here sin x into sin square x so sin sin that cancel so here if you have any confusion take the sin common sin x is there so 1 by cos x minus 1 if you take the LCM then you can get here sin x this here cos x 1 minus cos x so this that I directly write here now after that here you can get uh, 1 minus cos x cos x and uh, sin square x after that write here limit x turn to 0 so 1 minus cos x that I found then after here we can write sin x sin x into cos x minus cos x we can write 2 sin square x by 2 and here sin x we can write 2 sin x by 2 into cos x by 2 the same with this one 2 sin x by 2 into cos x by 2 and here cos x so this 2 to cancel sin x and this sin x cancel after that here you can get limit x tend to 0 1 and here 2 and this here cos square x by 2 cos x into cos x that is cos square x by 2 after that here this is limit no need to write the limit here so 1 this is 2 this here cos s square 0 by 2 cos 0 by 2 that is equal to 0 1 by 2 and here cos s square 0 we can write 0 by 2 that is equal to 0 so cos s square 0 the value that is equal to 1 so 1 by 2 into 1 that is equal to 1 by 2 so this is the answer of this limit question so one time going to repeat take the convert tan sin cos form take the sin common sum cancel here 1 minus cos x the formula is 2 sin square x by 2 this sin x convert into the into this is the formula of sin x 2 sin x by 2 into cos x by 2 this also need to change sin sin x sin x cancel this one 2 to cancel here you can get 2 into cos x cos square x by 2 so after that 1 by 2 put the value of limit 0 by 2 this is cos square 0 that is equal to 1 so finally you get here 1 by 2 so this is the way we can evaluate this limit question so now in this video it's over so thanks for watching see you next video thank you